<laughs> okay, today we are making Tiber cake. And what do we need for that? You know, we need three kind of packages of uh, cakes. Well, that is this. This one comes. You know, two of these come in this box. You know, so you need at least three of these. We need uh, four sticks of butter. We need some milk. <clears throat> We need about a pound of uh, ground walnuts, finely ground walnuts, five tablespoons of powdered sugar, and we need, you know, some dish where we're going to make it. You know, it doesn't have to be pan, it can be flat. There is no cooking involved in here. We also have uh, coffee, and uh, you can also use, you know, op optionally, I mean, coffee is optional. It can also be, instead of that, you know, maybe uh, cocoa. Cocoa mm. powder, you know. Or an Nesquik. Yeah, an Nesquik. Oh, why is this thing? Okay. So let's get started on this one. Okay, the first thing we need to do, we need to make this butter fluffy. So it needs to sit outside a little bit, you know, to get soft. We're going to use electric mixer to soften it up. And the base, you know, will be, we are going to use four by four. As a base, we are going to do five layers. Okay. So first I'm going to use a fork to kind of soften it up, you know, just to Momo don't uh, throw Sorry. pieces out. Just to chop it up a little bit, you know, and then uh, we'll start using mixer, you know, to make it nice and fluffy. Okay, this is hard on the mixer, so I'm going to try little by little. Okay, so now we are going to put, now that we have a butter roll nice and fluffy, you're going to put five tablespoons of uh, powdered sugar. sugar. Just a little bit. Don't put them. No, just, no, that's too much. Five. Okay, five. Okay, that's it. Okay, so now let's put uh, all these walnuts in there. Well, do we want to do a little that? Will, probably let's do add little by little, you know, and then start mixing, you know. Okay. Let's start. Do you want that? Okay, I think I should be doing that. Okay, start mixing, you know, and then I'll. No, use the. Oh, okay. Slowly. Sorry. Okay. Just. Okay, so we're back, and through the magic of television or movies, it has been mixed up. We have a mix of our butter, sugar, and uh, walnuts. Now I'm going to take all these back in the plate. We're going to start soaking them in the milk and coffee. But here's the thing, you know, if milk is too cold, it will really take long time, you know, for this to soak. So it's better if it is warm. If it is too hot, you know, so they need to be very soaked, but they can't be so soaked, you know, that they start falling apart. And, and the okay, loveliest... Let me put the first. Please. Okay, let me put another four. Okay, lovely assistant, can you get three more? Now. Because what he's doing is he's putting a little more of the milk on because yeah. they just didn't soak in enough. Well, except I, for, I didn't have enough. In the but one was a little too soaked, but the rest weren't right soaked enough. Right here is the tea soaked right here. I don't think you can see that right there. <clears throat> Okay, so what are we going to do next? Okay, so now we are going to... Okay, so now that I have one layer of and milk, I'm going to put a little bit of... a uh, little bit of our mix, a mix, and I'm going to spread it evenly, thinly and evenly across it. Completely covering the whole layer. So now the next layer, the next layer goes now the opposite way, you know, we are kind of doing, like, we are laying them this way, now we are going to lay them this way. Like this? Yes. But don't cut them on the below heart, okay. oh, cut so them on the a little, that way they stick yes. better. Yes. So, you know, 
Okay, so our chef and our assistant are having a little dispute over the quantity of moisture that should be in the cookie before it goes on. But putting that aside, yeah. just realize that next time you go back once again to the same way as you did on the first row, same and direction. And don't forget to put that spread too. Yeah, and then we're on our third layer. Um, when you're like doing this, it could get a little messy, so you might want to keep paper towels <laughs> around. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, now we're putting the third, we're putting the stuff on for the third layer, and we'll go ahead and do that. Okay, so we're on the final layer. We got all five layers, and now he's gonna. This is the last coat, and you're gonna coat it the top and sides, everything. Yeah, sides are. I think are we're gonna have a little bit left over, you know. I think we're gonna make a single cake from that. So we're gonna, we got it all over the sides of the top, five layers, and he just put a little milk on the top so he can make it nice and smooth. It just helps smooth it out a little bit. And that is it. And now what are we gonna do? How long do we need to refrigerate this puppy? Well, it, the best is if it sits overnight, you know, but you know, a few hours is okay, you know. Well, so you four or five hours, I think four or five hours should be. In the refrigerator. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, well that's let you know when we eat it. Come on, what do you say about your cake? It's good? Great. Okay, I think you did a great job. We! <laughs> okay, we did it. And for leftovers, we made a miniature cake. Okay. <laughs>